Okay, here we are, day two. I am Dr. Ray Benedetto of the Rapid Thyroid Recovery System. And we are here today, day two of our journey, uh, day two of eight in, in this, uh, this Rapid Thyroid Recovery System tutorial that I put together. This uh, class, if you will, or these lessons, these teachings, if you will, on all things thyroid, right? So everything from what is the thing you know, what is the thyroid? What does it do to how do I know if I have a problem? How do I get the help I need? What can I do? If I do have a thyroid problem, it's not getting better and everything in between. So I'm, I hope that the first video uh, from yesterday was helpful for you. Uh, if you missed it, it should still be somewhere in your inbox probably. Um, you can go back and rewatch it. Uh, it was kind of, hey, what is the thyroid? What does it do? How do I know if I have an underactive thyroid, an overactive thyroid, all the symptoms, things like that. So what we're going to do today is we're going to go over um, how do I find out if I have a thyroid problem, right? Or how do I get more clarity on what's causing my thyroid problem if I already have a diagnosis, but it's not improving with my medical treatment, okay? So either way, so, so if, you, if you're on one side of the, the uh, equation and you think to yourself, man, all those symptoms that you went over on that last video, I have a lot of them either on this side or this side, um, I think I need to get checked. Um, then again, you're going to want to go to your doctor and say, hey, can we please run these tests? On the other side of that equation is, no, you know what? I know I have a thyroid problem. I've been diagnosed. I'm taking medication, what have you. And my symptoms aren't going away. I'm not getting any better. I don't, I don't know why. It's been six months, six years, 10, 20 years, whatever. I have this thyroid condition, but I still have all these thyroid symptoms. That doesn't make sense. Then you're going to want to look at these tests also and see, hey, have I had all these tests run? Like has my doctor or doctors over the years actually run a complete panel of tests? So that way, if I'm not improving, why not? Like, are we missing something? I hope that makes sense. So this is, this is a, you know, a pretty complete test, right? A pretty complete list of tests here for the thyroid that um, if someone comes in my office or comes to me online sometimes, I would say, look, these are the tests we need to see right out of the gates before, so we can get a complete picture of your thyroid and what's going on with it, okay? So what are the tests that we need to run? These are just blood tests. They're not complicated, crazy tests. These are blood tests that your doctor can run, give you a script, you go to the regular lab that you always go to and they can run these. These are not like crazy special tests. Just most of the time, most of your doctors and endocrinologists also don't run these tests. Okay. So what are they? Some of them you may have seen, right? So TSH, which stands for thyroid stimulating hormone, right? That's the one. That's the screening test that everybody, all docs use to see if you have some kind of thyroid problem. It's called TSH, thyroid stimulating hormone. It's actually not a thyroid hormone test. It is a, the TSH is a pituitary hormone, and we'll get into that in, a, in another video, but it's the messenger that the pituitary gland sends to the thyroid that tells the thyroid, hey, you go ahead and make your hormones, okay, which are T4 and T3, okay? So we like to have a total T4 and a free T4, okay? So thyroid hormones, when they travel in the blood, they travel two ways. They travel free, right? Which is why we'd want to see a free T4 and a free T3. Or they travel in the blood, what is called bound. Okay, so it means that they have, they're attached to a protein that helps carry them around, kind of like a taxi cab. So we want to see total T4 because most of what your thyroid makes is T4. And again, we'll touch on that in a, in a video down the road. Um, most of what your thyroid makes is T4. So we want a total T4. How much of, it's, how much of it is, is bound? Like what's the total amount of it in the blood? And then how much is free? Free T3, something called T3 uptake, thyroglobulin, and these last two here are biggies, okay? And they're usually not run out of the gates. I mean, they are in, in my world, but out there with the rest of the docs, they just, they don't run them that, all that often if at all, right out of the gates, maybe down the road. And these are what are called thyro uh, thyroid antibodies, okay? There's two of them primarily for, uh, for hypothyroidism, which is, which is much more common. 
thyroid peroxidase antibodies or TPO antibodies and something called thyroglobulin antibodies or TGB antibodies, okay? Thyroid peroxidase, TPO antibodies, thyroglobulin, TGB antibodies. What these tests are for and what you're gonna find in the next video the, the tomorrow, to keep you in suspense, what you're gonna find tomorrow is that 90% of the time, so almost all the time, right? So 90% of the time, thyroid disease is cause, has one cause, right? It has one underlying cause 90% of the time. These tests, will, those two tests, those antibody tests, will look for and confirm if that is the cause for you, for your thyroid problem. And if it is, and it's, hu it's so huge to know because then when you take it to work on treating that root cause and not covering up the symptoms by giving the hormone, the thyroid hormone, which is done pretty much across the board in, in mainstream medicine. So I'm gonna have, again, kind of like we did on the last video, you're gonna have access to this PDF as a download. So you can, so you can download it, it's, it's with this video on this page. You can download uh, this video or this, um, this PDF. So that way you will have, you don't have to scramble right now to take notes, um, you yeah, write all this stuff down. You will have this document, this PDF that you can print out. So that way, if you wanna to go to your doctor and say, hey, look, you know, I think I have a thyroid problem because I have all these symptoms. Can we please run these tests? Or, hey, I have a thyroid problem and we've been treating it for all this time and we've never run most of these tests. So that way you'll have it as a, as a download PDF. It's yours to keep my gift to you. So uh, take home message from today is, do you think you have a thyroid problem and you have all those symptoms and you haven't been checked? These are the tests you wanna run. Just ask your doctor if you have a good relationship with them, why wouldn't they run them? Number two, if you have a thyroid problem and it's not getting better, even with treatment, and you haven't had all these tests run, you need to get them run. Print this out, ask your doctor, hey, can we please run these tests? We haven't run all these tests. I wanna have all the information. I wanna have all the cards on the table. I wanna know what I'm dealing with here. So that way uh, I can find the best path forward on how to manage it, how to treat it. Okay. So hopefully, again, this, this, uh, this short video was helpful for you as a, as a tutorial. Uh, you can download this PDF, it's yours. It's right on this page. If you have any questions for me, would like to book a consultation with me, have, you know, need me for anything or anything thyroid related, I'm here to help. You can shoot me an email. Um, I'm here. You can find me, Google me. <laughs> I'm not hard to find, I'm not hiding. So, uh, so if you need my help, I'm here to help, I'm here to serve. Uh, but hopefully this was helpful for you today as far as, okay, look, I get it now. Was with, you know, I, as far as, okay, I need a complete diagnosis. I need all these tests run so that we, I know what the problem is and we know how best to attack it, okay? So um, like I was talking about on these last two tests here, there's antibodies, 90% of the time there's one cause. Stay tuned, that's gonna be on the next video. We are going to go over that tomorrow. So everyone have a great day and uh, I wanna thank you for joining me.